The dolphin brought in by the fisherman is swimming in slow circles. The vet says that it has capture stress syndrome. The propeller is covered with a metal cage. That way an animal who swims too close won't get cut by the blade. The propeller is covered. A set of instructions ensures that all helpers treat the dolphin alike. Hi! Hey, you're swimming better than yesterday. You'll feel better in no time at all, and we can take you home. You've had a tough time. But we're not trying to keep you or anything. We're just trying to help you get better. Adam's soothing voice got through to him. It looks like he's decided to make friends. The dolphin eyes the bucket by the door. Adam picks up a mackerel. The dolphin chows down on the mackerel. Adam picks up a mackerel. Yes, he swallowed another one. Moving slowly and carefully, Adam climbs into the pool. He can feel the dolphin's delight at having some company. The weird clicking sound means the dolphin is memorizing Adam by bouncing sound waves off him. It's called a sonar click. was fun! Do it again! Hey, where are you going? Whoa, good one! You're making me dizzy! Catch me if you can, huh? The dolphin offers his dorsal fin to Adam. He wants to give Adam a ride. Whoa, I accept. Adam cups his hand and the dolphin swims up under it and pulls Adam into a whirling, swooping ride around the pool. That was the greatest! The dolphin looks really frisky now that he's pulled Adam around. He wants to play some more. Adam takes the green frisbee. The dolphin's psyched up and ready to play. There's no sense.
I did. Er, I guess the hermit's out of the crab, so to speak. Allow me to introduce myself, Adam. And you know my name? Nothing wrong with my hearing, above or underwater. As I was trying to say, my name's Delphinius. Deller what? Delphinius. Got it? Delphinius. Got it. Complicated name. Cetus, our great whale king, named me. Of course, it sounds different in our language. Sort of like this. I believe your human scientists call that my signature whistle. I also speak tuna and some of the more obscure coral dialects. Those are too high-pitched for you to hear. Anyway, they're only useful in my kingdom. Cool! Your kingdom? Right, my kingdom. It's... Oh no! My kingdom! Cetus! I remember now. I don't know what I've been thinking. How long have I been here? About a week. You're in pretty bad shape. A week? What a disaster! I've got to get out of here right away! Hold on! I'm not getting this! What are you talking about? What's the matter? That's me all over, just rushing straight ahead, not looking where I'm going. That's how I got into this mess in the first place. When I ran into that net, it's because I was searching for Cetus. He's missing and I was sent to find him. Maybe he's in trouble, or hurt, or worse. I have to find out before it's too late. Adam, please help me get out of here. Of course I'll help you, Dolphinius. Almost ready anyway, so he wouldn't mind. I guess this is it. I'd say to thank your dad, but he'd think you were nuts. My dad might surprise you. Are you sure you have to go? See, this is my king, Adam. If he needs my help, I can't fail him. But I won't forget you. I won't forget you either, Dolphinius. Good luck. Adam watches sadly as Delphinius swims out to sea. 